guys, Eric G with Around the House radio show and podcast. We're back talking about my favorite product, Sense. Now I've had Sense for a number of years within my house, so I've been tracking all of my energy usage, but now there's Sense Flex, where I can add two different contacts to this to measure electrical circuits like my heat pump or something like that, that is now running my air conditioning system so I can see how my energy usage is. This is a cool product. I'm gonna add this onto here so we can make sure that I'm doing that and we'll show you the upgrade. You can reliably monitor up to 220 volt or a single 240 volt circuit directly. Perfect for large loads like HVAC systems, generators, 400 amp service, EV chargers, or hard to detect variable motors like heat pumps or air conditioners. Now the first thing before you get into the panel like this, you wanna make sure you turn the power off because well, nobody has to tell you how dangerous this can be if you touch the wrong stuff. Now we're gonna connect these two new sensors to the unit so we can track a circuit. So with my regular sense box right here, you're gonna pop out the little cover here, and then we're gonna take these and hook them up to the new lines. I wanna monitor this circuit right here, so we will close these around the circuit, and then all we have to do is plug this in here into that middle area. It's that simple as the app guides you or the electrician through the setup. Don't forget to make the changes in the app so the app knows you have installed the sensors and that you can name that circuit correctly. Now it's time to put this panel back together just so we can make sure it's safe. Now is the time we're gonna talk about a little bit about energy efficiency. And with power rates these days not going down, let's save a little money. All right, how many of you guys out there have that beverage fridge? You know, the one out buried in the garage like mine. If it's over 10 years old, it can be costing you money. About 150 to $200 a year extra money. Yeah, you gotta maintain it. Let's go clean out the coils down below. This is really simple. Kick off this toe kick. Yeah, it's the thing that's hiding all that dirt. Get in here with the shot back or your vacuum. Clean it all out. You're good to go. Put the toe kick back and now you're saving energy. Do this every six months, it'll put money back in the pocket and you can watch it on your sense. Now heat and water is expensive in your home. I switched over to a heat pump water heater. Think of it as a heat pump for your house. It just works on doing the water. Now, this is super energy efficient where you've got a regular water heater. This only uses 500 watts, like five light bulbs to heat your water because it's using that compressor and coils like you would to heat your home. It's a great way to put money back in that pocket and you can all watch it on your sense. Front load washing machines have been around forever and they can save you a ton of money over that top load unit. That top load unit can use actually about 50 gallons of water when it goes through a cycle on average. These can use as little as 10. That's a lot less water to heat and use on your water bill. And our last tip of the day, let's talk heating and cooling for a minute. If you're not changing that filter regularly, that can be costing you a bunch of money because it's not efficient of a system. Maybe you've got that little one inch filter that could just be a few dollars to get it. I'd get a nicer one, get the best filter you can afford. Now, mine, it's a much more expensive filter, but it lasts six months and it can cost upwards of $100, but it's doing a lot of different things. Either way, it's giving you indoor air quality, and of course, it's saving you money on electricity that you can watch with your Sense unit. All right, I've got the Sense Flex sensors in, and now that I can see my outdoor compressor for my HVAC unit is using about 2,400 watts, and I can see when it is running and what it could cost me. I hope those tips helped you out. They're a good reminder that could save you money and extend the life of those appliances. Now, if you're using that Sense correctly, you can keep an eye out and see what's costing you money, and maybe it's time to invest in a few new things.